Let me start it off first thing, ain't shoot like this How to see your city, bet they ain't like this I'm the man, Instagram, take a pic like this All the way, while I whip it like this Counting up and flexing, yeah, just like this Got me cross the bed What's up guys? It's me, Robin. Shane's channel today. And today, I'll be teaching you guys how to do the whirlwind. So, first off, you wanna hit on spike. And then you wanna practice your urts. So your urts, you wanna practice it. So you get it about if you get hurts about five times and you're ready so you want to get it at least five times oh yeah when you guys are done with that you guys are gonna want to um, can flip it as you see your your hole coming up the top like this so you don't want to do it like this like that. So, yeah. I'm going to show you guys one more time. You guys get it. So, yeah. When you get it on peg, you basically want to earth it like that. You're going to want to earth it. And then you can flip it when you see your hole right over here at the top. And so, you're gonna wanna do that. Practice that. And do so then, um, thank you guys for watching my tutorial. And we'll be doing um inward lunar tutorial next, so yeah. Guys, we're gonna be doing um inward lunar tutorial. So first you have to master um regular lunar. This you have to master it first. And then you have to keep practicing. So um what you wanna do is when you do when you wanna do um lunar, you have to have um the ball the um can the tama on in your hand and the can has to come up. So if you guys want to do inward, you have to do it um, the opposite way. Like this, as you can see, but it's a little wobbly with this kinama. And if you want to do double, it's hard. So if you've seen um, my friend's video earlier, you guys see how to do whirlwind. But let's see if we can try to master um, Inward, lunar, right now. Try to land in front of you guys. Hold on. Let's get that much of a razor if you guys want to go buy it. Yeah, it's a razor. It doesn't have any local though. You guys are gonna be seeing um, me and my friend Brylin do um, kind of, I'm not, um, us trying to compete against each other in Dama next. See you guys in just a second. Oh. Brylin, again on Shane's channel. So today's tutorial is what kendamas to buy and what kendamas not to buy. So and then today, we're gonna be doing um, a juggle one. So okay, the kinama so. you really want to buy right now, if you guys are starting for beginners, is um, kina sweets. Wait, a pill is what you need to start with. Not a pill. So a pill, 
We're not talking about drugs, drugs. We're just Ta talking about. Can I have a pill? Can I have a pill for Okay, so today, the cannabis that you should not buy is tributes because they suck. Kinamico? No, Kinamico's are good. Kinamico sucks. They're better. Better than tributes. Way better than tributes. Okay, so what not to buy is, of course, a tribute because they suck good. What else? Yo Mega, never buy Yo Mega. Yo Mega's good. Yo Mega sucks. Uh, hmm. Oh. Ow, my knee. And Kayla Kendamas. Kayla Kendamas sucks. Oh, yeah. And the Kendamas that you should buy? Homegrown Crazewood. Kendamaco. Sweets. Sweets. Crazewood. That's the one I have. Can I have a Sunrise? No, not the No, they don't. They do. No, they don't. Sunrise, you should buy. Mm. Kaizen. Kaizen. Cherrywood. No, not Cherrywood. Oh, don't, don't, don't get Cherrywood. Cherrywood sucks. The cherry on cherry good, wood is good. But the tip is too small. <laughs> Can't um, do it. What else? This Kanama, I don't, this is from Racer, I don't know what the heck brand this is. Doesn't even show. So yeah, those are the four things you should buy a Kanama to um, start. You should buy a Kanama Co. Sweets. Um, what else? What else? Hi, oh, um, crazy man. Sunrise, definitely sunrise. Hold on. I already said sweets. And um, yeah. Hope you guys like the video. If you guys don't know what those are or what brand those are, click on the link below. Right there. And yeah. Thanks for watching your video. And I'm going to be doing um, Kitama, Kitama tutorial. I'm going to be doing a Kitama tutorial. If Bradley wants to join in, you can join in. So, hope you guys like it. Leave a like, subscribe, down below. This is going to be the last video. And, yep, bye. So, if you guys want to learn how to do, um, um, one term lighthouse, you have to match the lighthouse first. This, this is lighthouse right here. It's a regular lighthouse. Oh, I can kill you guys for Then you're going to do it like this. you got to make it to pay. First, let's master it. And you can do it like you can do it like this, like this, and then you go bang. So if you guys want to do one turn, you do it like this, like that. So let's do it. Let's do it in a trick. So if you guys want to do it, so you go like this. If you guys do you want to go in a trick, like this. This old trick. Trick you could do. Trick you could do. Sorry if I'm feeling a lot. I'm so tired. Like this. And then you go like that. Trick. Any kind of trick. Like this. Okay. So, I hope you guys have learned something from this um, video. It's going to be in my other videos. I did so much tutorials. My friend over there tried to do um, uh, Dama, Ken Dama contest, but couldn't. Didn't have enough time. Because. I didn't, so hope you guys learned something from this. And yeah, leave a like, subscribe, and hope you guys liked it. Bye!